Okay, hello everybody. So hopefully you guys can all hear me okay and uh, you'll be able to actually see what we're playing today. So this is a game called A Story About My Uncle. I've never heard of it before, to be quite honest, but um, it's the free game on the Humble Bundle store at the moment. And uh, you can get it just by signing up for their uh, newsletter that I was already signed up for. So um, decided to download it and check it out. So hopefully you guys will uh, enjoy it. Right, I'm just going to dive right in and give it a go. So let's see what this game's all about. Dad? Aren't you sleeping yet? It's time for bed, honey. Dad, I can't sleep. Can you tell me a bedtime story? All right. What do you want to hear? Something... something about an adventure. Hmm... I think I know just the thing. <laughs> when I was your age... I'm liking the accent so far. My biggest dream was to follow my Uncle Fred on one of his adventures around the world. One day, he disappeared. Ooh, mysterious. Now let me just check. Oh! Alright, my gamepad does work. Awesome. Then that is what I shall use. I stepped into the lobby of my uncle's house. It lay just across the hill from where I lived with my mother, your grandmother. She had tried to keep me from going, but I wanted to see see if Fred was home yet from his latest adventure. Hmm. It's a nice house. I really like the brickwork on the inside. That's pretty cool. Do not forget... Turn off turbine, oven, reactor, and lights. Hmm. Well, everybody, it is 25 to 4. And uh, it seems pretty dark. Weird. Okay. Oh, To Uncle Fred. I wonder if that was me. Uh, I don't really know what accent that is, or what uh, language that is. Ooh. Well, that's all highlighted, so I guess I'm meant to go and touch that. My uncle used to send me postcards from his long journeys. Greetings from Nepal, Galapagos, Galapagos Kilimanjaro, the Amazon River. This was the first time he had left the world. He's been to Bahrain, but he's not been to Oman. Okay, let's see. Oh, he's not been to the UK either. Interesting. Been to the US a couple of times. Now that looks interesting. I had visited Uncle Fred's house. My God. Of times. Huh. But in the locker, which usually was closed, I found something I hadn't Fantastic seen Fantastic Frederick's disposal it system. It resembled the one that Fred used, but smaller in size. An adventure suit. Curiosity got the better of me, and I tried it on. Of course you did, mate. It you weren't just going to leave that lying around. It custom made for me. Oh, it might have been. Ooh. Some really nice graphics. Ventilation. Really necessary? Or is that ventilation? Really necessary! Let's see what's going on. The most mysterious room of my uncle's house was the observatory. Ooh. There he kept his newest pretty. experiments, and right now it is very pretty. Used for disposing of garbage. Uncle Fred had warned me not to. <laughs> is it going to dispose of, of me? But, oh no! As I said, I was a curious child. Pull the lever to launch. Very well. Uh oh. Burger Dome. It's not like a museum anymore. Oh. Uh. Um. Oh. Uh. Hmm. Uh. Hmm. This, uh, this doesn't seem quite right. Oh. Whoa. All right. Okay. Okay. With a crash, but thanks to the suit, I wasn't hurt. Instant noodles. Whoa. Okay. But back then, I didn't care so much about where I was going, or 
how I would get home. Uh, I kind of care about how I'm going to get home. There's lots of just rubbish here. Well, I guess it's meant to be like a rubbish disposal area. How... How irresponsible of Uncle Frederick to just fire his rubbish off into the great unknown. That's an old left bumper to run. Okay. The suit protected me from falls in the ground, but not in water. I couldn't swim with this thing on. Best be careful. Oh, uh, uh oh. Um, oh. Okay. Well, doesn't seem all that bad. Okay. This is going to hurt. Not even vaguely. There's got to be an enemy around here somewhere, right? Someone waiting to have a wee munch on me. Ooh. I was sure that someone it's ready had to go. Been here before me. Someone had built these bridges and carved these symbols, but who? Where? Well, are they now? I mean, probably Uncle Frederick, right? Whoa! Whoa! Haha! <laughs> That's pretty cool. Oh. Was there some sort of beacon there? I found a strange gizmo, some oh. sort of measuring tool that Fred must have built. It seemed to be done measuring, though, so I took the results to give to Fred. Wherever he might be. Okay, this is going to be a sprinted... Oh, piss. Oh, no. All the way back here. Um. Whoa. Okay. Oh. Can I reach it on the upswing? No, I can't. Ah, there we go. Safely back on the ground. Lovely. Very nice. Okay. Uh, have we launch across here? Now, I know I meant to go that way. That much is fairly obvious. But, definitely want to explore over here. Oh. Okay. Oh, what's this? How did you know Fred had been there? Well, I found a small campsite where Fred must have slept before going further into the caves. <laughs> and Fred was an absolute slob, so all he drank was Powerade and ate super noodles. Packages of his favorite hiking foods: canned soups, tube food, and instant noodles. Tube food. That sounds gross. Oh well, it's not that bad. One winter, Uncle Fred and I went hiking into the mountains, and we were surprised by a blizzard. We were stuck in a small cabin for two days, and all we ate was tube food. Hey, this sounds an awful lot about Bryn and his nephew. Uh, sounds an awful lot like Bryn and his nephew. If any of you guys have seen Gavin and Stacy, you know what I'm talking about. I wonder if Uncle Frederick did something gravity divine with soup as well. Oh, oh, damn it. Didn't let it charge. Did I? That was silly. Ah, oh, damn. Right, okay. Trying to run before we can walk, I get it. Cool, 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 that's fine. That's fine. Right. Okay, so I probably want to go down there. But where I really want to go is up here. Uh, damn it. Okay. Can you tell? I'm not very good at platformers. Why walk anywhere when you can super jump? Power core I found activated the suit's grappling device when I picked it up. It must have been left here by Uncle. Whoa! That's cool! Oh man, wicked. Love it. Ready, oh, okay. And I was getting more and more certain that this place was where Fred had gone. Just hanging out up here for a while. Doing his cave paintings. Whoa. Okay. Cool. Ugh. Balls. Ah, oh, could have grappled. 
Oh, I'm so bad. I'm so bad at this. It's just terrible. Go on. Go. Nope. Uh, and there was a zip on down there. Good, good, good. Zip back up. Uh, balls. I wonder if it stays. No, 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 no. Like, I'm not fantastic at video games. But I'm better than this. Okay. Right, so what? We're looking for Uncle Fred, right? Why on earth would we just... Put on this suit and go disappearing up into the sky, looking for our weird uncle who builds random shit. Suit. <sighs> Hopefully you get motion sick. Oh god, no, I've nobbed it. No, no, balls. No, I did the same thing again! Why did I do it again? Come on! Okay. I keep forgetting that you need to charge your glove before you can jump. Right, that's my problem. I keep forgetting that. Well, it's one of several problems, but let's just go with that one for now. Oh, oh I forgot again, guys. You see that? I, I forgot again. Jesus. Okay. Okay, okay. Lucky, lucky I had good enough reaction times to stop myself. That looks like a crying face. <gasps> Telling you, I'm never gonna get this jump again, right? It's just not gonna happen. Uh. Uh. Okay, uh, slightly more up than I was intending. Oh bollocks! Uh. Okay, come on. Yes, gotcha. So whipping me across. Okay, cool. So you just got to keep your angular momentum in mind. Look at me being all scientisty. Whoa. Okay, and uh. Okay, cool. All right. So you can modify what direction you're going a fair bit just by moving. Good. 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 Thought I'd nobbed it there for a second, but I absolutely had not. I had nailed it. Okay. Oh. Well, I thought I was going to have to... <gasps> okay. Let's try this again. Oh! Nice. You can now grapple two times before landing. Amazing. Oh, come on. Oh. Yeah, okay, that's on me. Okay. Oh, ho, 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 ho. saved myself. Uh. Uh. <sighs> okay. My goodness me. Right, well, grab one and hold on tight. Uh, yes, seamless, seamless, loving it. Okay. My God. Right. Okay. Whew. <laughs> Boy, am I glad that that works. I'm really liking these wee symbols. They're kind of reminding me of um, of Zelda Breath of the Wild, like some of the artistry in, in that. Uh, it's pretty cool, kind of tribal, but not quite. Uh, oh. Did you ever see any of Fred's experiments yourself? Oh, yeah, yes. I actually help him collect samples for his research sometimes. To learn about them? That's right. We found all sorts of things. One time, we went to the forest. 
and found a small pool of water that was full of eggs. Eggs? Were there chickens in the forest? No, not chicken eggs. Hmm. These were small and jelly-like. Hundreds of them. Fred told me that they were frog eggs. He was in for a surprise, though. Guess what happened? What? What happened? Well, we took some eggs back home, and one day, oh dear. Fred woke up. Mosquitoes? All over his body. Turns out, it wasn't frog oh, eggs. Oh, yes! Was mosquito eggs. Bloody knew it. Oh, poor Fred. I know. He did find real frog eggs eventually. Call them midges in Scotland. Actually, I'm not entirely sure that we do. Now, I don't know whether someone was pulling my leg, but somebody told me that midges and mosquitoes are not the same thing. And I don't know whether to believe them. Don't know if there's any other Scottish people about that might be able to help me out there. But, uh, yep, not a clue. Not a clue. Oh, nice. A bit of a change of scenery. It's quite nice, kind of... Oh, very pretty. Quite dark though. Holy hell. A bit difficult to see. Oh, wow. 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 Look at the environments in this game. Amazing. Hello. Who are you? Oh, shit. Whoa. Here. Wow. You look just like Fred, but smaller and with less hair on your face. <laughs> she knew Fred. I told her that he was my uncle and that I was glad I can back up quickly. I'm Madeline. The others call me Mad Maddie sometimes. That just seems a bit kind of I don't know why really. unnecessary. You Mad Maddie. Maddie. It's not even shorter than Madeline. You've never been to the village, right? Now, I saw a review for this game that says you don't even have to think about where you're going. You just look at it and you go there. Bollocks. I have to constantly think about where I'm going. Seriously. I would just get completely lost otherwise. Look, there's no way. I'm just like, oh yeah, let's just dunder along. Okay, I'm just, I'm just gonna give that a go. Yep, see, didn't didn't even think about that one. Uh Whoa, okay. <sighs> yeah, no, let's let's definitely look before we leave. Just a little bit. So this is the village. Are we going to meet the village people? Hey! Hi, welcome to my village. This is the town square, and that over there is Fred's tent. I haven't seen him in a few days, though. Maybe our elder Samuel knows where he is. He knows a lot of stuff. I'll go on ahead and tell him that you're coming. Uh, not much for surprises. Uh, jeez. Has he seen your face? Because that was a bit of a surprise. I thanked Madeline and agreed to meet her later. It was strange. How could I talk to someone who was not uh, human? She's got a bit of the uncanny valley about her. <sighs> okay. Uh, so, we've got Fred over there. <laughs> hey, Heisenberg. Lovely. Did they watch Breaking Bad here? Crowbar. Martin Freeman reference. Gordon Freeman. Not Martin Freeman. Ugh. Oh, God. Oh, God. This is really, really disturbing. I don't like it. Uh -uh. Nope. Nope. My God! Just look at that! Oh! Amazing. I mean, so the game looks absolutely wonderful, right? It just looks absolutely fantastic. Then there are these horrible freaks, whose arms just kind of clip into themselves at a moment's notice. Look at that horrible shit! And then, there's this fire. It just looks more like cotton candy. <laughs> Maybe Uncle Frederick is like, the Charles Manson of these guys. Some sort of weird cult leader. Oop, okay. Let's try that again. So, I've got to jump. Then pull myself up to there. There we go. Just bash my face off it. Oh, a bottle of special brew. Loving it. 
Hey. Uh. The substance that seems to have triggered the quickening of the eggs is a bluish crystal with a fluorescent effect. Are these the frog things? Happy birthday, Uncle Fred. Mom says you are four times as big as me now. Me, ten years. You, forty years. For how long to Fred gone? from Maddie. I'm not sure. A couple of months, I think. Less than half a year, for sure. I remembered hiking with him the summer before. But when I counted the days in his journal... It is! ...and from when I last saw him, it didn't make sense. Maddie said that she had known him all her life. Ah, I think these guys just, like, grow exponentially, right? So... Figure... Like, she didn't really mean it. Like, when you say you'll die if you don't get a puppy for your birthday... That's true, though. <laughs> I'm sorry. Of course it is. 27 days after arrival. I named one of the little froglings Madeline after my old journey companion. I bet she would have loved this adventure. Anyway, the little frog lives up to her name. So curious and inventive. Eager to learn as well. The She even asked me to teach her how to write. Interesting. Interesting. Oh, right bumper still zooms. You know what? I probably didn't even have to zoom it, like lean in, crick my neck for that. Nope, could I just zoomed in? Right, cool, cool, off we go. Good to know. See, the thing is, the same button that zooms in is the one that you use to do your like your zipping about, right? Your your super jump. So it just it it confuses me because it seems to change randomly. When, you know, I least expect it. I suppose, like, when his hand goes away is meant to be the trigger for you thinking, like, ah, perhaps I can zoom in on stuff now. But I don't use it that frequently. And I just, it, because it, because it happens so infrequently, I often forget, was what I was going to say before I died like an idiot. Pressing the button, just now it's happening, and nailed it. A stranger in our halls. Welcome. So what was his name? name? Sam. Samuel. Yeah, Sam. And we will do our best to assist you. Your help will not be necessary. The crystal is not That's right. to have. Yeah, freak. What? I want to help finding Fred. Why couldn't I? Please, madam, that is impossible. None of us may enter the chasms. It is too dangerous. That's right, too What's dangerous. The danger. If Fred can do it, so can I. I say this for your own protection, madam. You are forbidden from entering the chasms. Just because you're afraid of what's outside the village oh. doesn't mean I am. I'm nothing like you. Ooh. I'll never be. Throwing some shade, jeez. Oh. We apologize. It is true that we want to keep her safe, but she does not understand. Dear, <laughs> weird, like half-speed run. Behind us is the power core. Take it and go into the chasms. Find Fred. Will do. And if you see Madeline, take care of her. Cool. Be safe. Will do. Thank you. Three jumps, please. Yes. Yes, indeed. So, do we need to zip up there? No. Oh, so, I think we'll try and reach the chasms, wherever that is, and uh, then we will put this one to rest just for the minute. Because uh, I, uh, like a fool, started this stream at about, uh, about 11 o'clock at night. So, uh, I'm a wee bit tired. And uh, need me beauty sleep, you understand, of course. Me. Oh. Uh, no. Okay, I've got to try and 
get this right so that I'm kind of just swinging on th through without actually bumping my face off of those rocks. There we go. Easy. Easy as pie. Easy when you got the know-how. Hit it. It is. Okay. Ah, damn it. Ah! So close. I came so close. God damn it. And there's that impatience showing again. Please. No. <laughs> ah. Why? Thank you. Okay. Darkness swept over me as I left the glittering lights in the village behind me and headed for the ominous shadows of the chasms. Creepy. All right. Well, well, thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you uh, hope you enjoyed a little bit of that uh, game that's called uh, A Story About My Uncle. Sorry, forgot there for a second. Um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed that. Uh, I'll probably play some more. It's not really my sort of game, but I am enjoying it. I'm enjoying it. It's a little bit frustrating, but it's just because I'm terrible. So uh, if you guys enjoyed it, let me know. Um, if not, then uh, I'll play something else. So thank you very much for watching, and uh, I'll speak to you later. Goodbye.